these three little men in Jaya Malini's life more than make up for the one man who left them eight years ago. Emmanuel, her middle child, has global developmental delay and brain seizures. And Isaiah, her youngest, has ADHD. This single mother digs deep within herself to care for her sons. I cry. My crying is make me more stronger. I will tell myself, yes, still can do it. Don't give up. Still can do it. I motivate myself a lot. Smiling is very important also. Because the more you smile, the more you laugh, the more your body strength. Like you want to be firm. That's why I say smile. You want to look good to others, you must tell yourself, you are good. That's why my crying part also, lesser, lesser, lesser. I see a lot of comedy movies, so I start laughing. When I laugh a lot, okay, I feel more relieved, relieved, relieved. I mean, laughing is a good exercise also. <laughs> I do exercise also, that's another relaxation of mine. She initially received financial help from agencies, but she's now self-reliant, doing odd jobs from home. My father always taught me, pay everything first. Whatever balance you have, save. So I start saving, 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 20%, 20%. Somehow, 80% must pay all, the PUB all is very important. If not, <laughs> they will come after. I don't want anyone to come after. I must not be an embarrassment for them. God has a plan. God knows what to do. God also knows who's the strong woman really can take care of this kind of children. But there's a limit to what one woman can do. That's when eldest son Isaac steps up. She depends on me because I'm the oldest and I have more knowledge. Even she's tired, she takes a rest and I take over. My mom, she's teaching me more about my brothers and how to handle them. He takes particular care with Emmanuel. I have to be there for him always. It's not because my mother has said that, it's that because he's in this situation. Uh, when I'm getting older, I think it's easier because he's, he's also getting older. And he's getting to know more things and he understands so I'm more prepared and confident in myself and my two brothers. I, he's a, a pillar for me. Whenever I'm down, I, will I tell him, you can still live without me, okay? You don't forget you've got two more brothers. You are the elders. You're going to be a master in this house. So you must know how to handle. Whatever I'm handling, whatever I'm teaching you, you must learn. And then he's been seeing me since young, he's been watching me how I step by step come up, how I, I start doing my things. A lot of respect, a lot of respect I am given to my old teachers. I'm very strict, but I'm very lovable and very kind mom to them. I have something very strong in my heart. I'm not going to do it. I will never do that, and I don't want to do that. 